out by the front of the house. Right. Okay, so look, we have beehives. And I'm here with the bee lady. Okay. <laughs> and uh, what, 60 hives here? Yeah. And look at them, look at the bees just going crazy. Wow. So these are all honey bees. Yes. And honey. so like... Aethis Malthia. So you're going to overwinter these guys, right? Uh, most of them are going to go on a road trip to Florida and enjoy the nice sunny weather and oh, be back gotcha. in the spring. Gotcha. Yep. They're a little bit too small to overwinter this year, so... Yeah. So on average, like what... How much honey can you get from one hive out of a season? Oh, with these guys, probably about 50 pounds each. Oh, wow. So it could be quite a bit. We don't normally do like honey, honey. We're mostly into like selling the bees. So. Oh, yeah, yeah. But we do, we'll do about a 55 gallons worth of honey a year. That's a lot of honey. Yeah, 55 <laughs> gallons. So think of a 55 gallon drum. That's about, I get all, all year long. And that's about nine to ten you know five gallon buckets right so if you break it down looking at that it's really not that much but we try to feed the bees and let them have as much as possible going you know going down to florida because when you get them down to florida there ain't much feed down there it's winter time too right so people think that there's like stuff all year round in florida and that's not the case everything goes dormant yep yeah even even way down south there and even that's good for the bees too because they get a uh, a break in their brood and then we can we can treat for the mites and then um once we treat for the mites they'll be healthier because when they get a break in the brood those mites can't hide in the cap cells right so, and right that's, the mites carry all kinds of viruses and bad things for the bees yeah thank you china thank you china yeah right that's where those come from right well, this is pretty cool. Uh, I've never seen that many beehives in one spot before. <laughs> but I think it's a neat process, you know, and I, I kind of keep up with the, I try to keep up with the bee world. And I, lot, I know a lot of people are going into even those horizontal hives. Mm -hmm. And uh, those seem to be possibly a little bit of a wave of the future, at least for the homesteader, if you want to get into the honey stuff. But wow, cool, well, thanks. Uh, do you care if I put this on my YouTube channel? Have it. <laughs> okay. This is Patty, and she is an expert on bees and honey production here in northern Ohio. Okay, bye. Bye. <laughs>